हेलो एवरीवन आई एम वीरेंद्र राजपूत एंड यू आर वाचिंग कैड लर्निंग रिसोर्सेस यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस ऑटो कैड ट्यूटोरियल यू विल लर्न टू ड्रॉ आर्क बाय यूजिंग एलेवन मेथड्स सो लेट स्टार्ट सो यू कैन फाइंड आर्क कमांड इन ड्रॉ टूल बार हियर सो योर डिफॉल्ट ऑप्शन इज थ्री पॉइंट आर्क यू कैन क्लिक ऑन द डाउन एरो ऑन द आर्क so you will find 11 different options here to draw arc or you can also type a that is shortcut for arc in the command line and press enter so it ask you to specify start point of the arc so i click here on the screen is the start point now it is asking me to specify second point so i click here and now third point to end the arc again i type a in the command window press enter now it is asking me to specify point of arc or i can press down arrow key from the keyboard and i can change the first point to the center point now the first point i click on the screen is center point now start point and end point so if i click here now you will see the arc is in anti clockwise direction suppose i wanted to draw arc in clockwise direction and only this segment so for that again type a in command line press enter press down arrow key click on the center then click here as a center point this is first start point and now you will see by default it is anti clockwise ka r but now i want to make it clockwise so press and hold control key and now you can see r is in clockwise direction now i can click here so this is simple three point arc you can draw it from command window or here default is three point arc click on three point from the draw toolbar and you have to specify three points so i will take this first point the second point and third point so this is the simplest type of arc by using three points now for another option click on the down arrow and you will find second option start center and end so this first first point that you specify is start point second point center point and third is end point so i will take start center end and i will click here as a start point the second point as a center point and third point is end point so here you observe the arc is in anti clockwise direction by default suppose i wanted to draw arc in clockwise direction then again i will select start end center option i will click here first point the second center point and now to make arc clockwise press and hold control key and now you can see it is in clockwise direction and now this third point is end point now next option is start center and angle so click on start center angle so first point is start point second is center point and now you have to specify the angle suppose here i specify angle 60 degree and press enter so this arc is having included angle of 60 degree so next option is 
start center and chord length so i will click here now i will take this point as a start point and this point center point and now i have to specify the chord length let us say i will specify chord length as 40 mm and click here so this length is 40 i will show you by measuring the distance so from this point to this point the chord length is 40 next option is start end and angle this is similar to start center and angle here you have to specify start point and center point but here you have to specify start and end point then include an angle so click on start end angle let us say this is start point this is end point and now you have to specify the angle included angle i will specify here 135 and press enter now suppose i click here and you can see this included angle of this arc is 135 then next option is start end and direction so i will click here so first point is start point end point now you have to specify direction if i click here it will be on the right hand side and if i click on the left side the arc will be on the left side so suppose i click here again i will take start end and direction so first point end point and direction next option is start end radius so i will click here first point start point end point and now i have to specify radius i will type 30 present so if i want this arc from this side then again i will take start end radius so i will change my point from here start point end point and radius so for example i will take 30 again you can change start point and reverse the direction of the arc or there is one more option for it so i will click on start end radius let's say here star point end point and now radius so to reverse the direction of arc press and hold control and drag the mouse and now type radius here let's say 25 and press enter so arc will be from this side so next option is center start and end so i will take this first point center this start point and this end point now it's anti-clockwise again i will take center start end so center is start and this end point or again i will take center start end so let us say this center start and end but now this time it is anti clockwise again i will take center start end same center point start point but i want this clockwise so i will press and hold control and now this point next option is center start and angle so this center is start and now i will specify 
एंगल लेट से 60 डिग्री एंड प्रेस एंटर सो यू कैन सी द इंक्लूडेड एंगल इज 60 डिग्री सेंटर पॉइंट स्टार्ट पॉइंट एंड फ्रॉम स्टार्ट पॉइंट द इंक्लूडेड एंगल इज 60 डिग्री सो नेक्स्ट ऑप्शन इज सेंटर स्टार्ट एंड लेंथ फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई विल टेक here center is start and this as a length 100 mm you click here so last option is continue arc when you click on the arc and again you click on the continue so arc continues from the previous point and here you can click anywhere on the screen again continue and draw shapes as you wish again i will click on the r can continue now you can change direction of the arc by press and hold control key so in this way we have seen all 11 options to draw arc Thank you for watching please like subscribe and share my video thank you